morning students and uh, today is the second case study that we are going to discuss and the case study that we are going to discuss today for total quality management is we are going to discuss about the two case studies are in the world and to say about the introduction by integrating a system of total quality management it is possible to have both quality and quantity that means we know that both the things quality and quantity are of very important Because yes, whatever may as I discussed in the previous case study itself, whatever may be the industry, either it may be the manufacturing industry or a service industry, the thing quality is stands first. That means without quality, the customer retention is will be a big question mark. So each and every person is starting the business for the purpose of earning more profit. But the thing. Uh, along with the profit that they want to earn they want to concentrate in their mind about the quality that they are delivering to the customers so as i said here we can see that total quality management by implementation of it we can have the both quality as well as quantity there are plenty of methods and models geared at managing the quality of particular companies goods and services that means there are many tools of qualities are there that means using the various tools it doesn't mean that all the companies and industries are using the same tool for implementation of total quality management in their industry that means uh, co several seven quality tools are available and the new quality tools are also available so based upon any of the quality tool they implement in their own industry so that they will compare themselves before implementation of tkm and after implementation of tkm what is the output like that uh, we can go for then the management consultant william demings developed an extremely entirely new set of methods which to address quality we know the, we know the demings principle that we in the second unit itself we have discussed about the demings principle so what is meant by the who is deming and what are what are his contribution similarly also we have discussed about the contribution of cross by similar to where other philosophies who discuss about the importance of quality and today's class we will discuss about two case studies that means before implementation and after implementation of tkm what is happened in these two major industries we will discuss about one that is atlantic car and another one is santa cruz guitar company limited so first thing in the we will discuss about the At- atlantic car one for one firm that proven the merit of total quality management in is new jersey based healthcare provider atlantic care so healthcare means we know they are the manufacturer of medicines farm uh, tablets then the vaccines etc so here the main thing is there how the customer will get satisfied how the customer will get retention means the pharmacy pharmaceutical products that are produced by them is in the position to rectify the complaint or the disease of the patients so they have discussed what is importance for them how the customers will get satisfied means only by means of curing the disease of the customers so managing 5000 employees at 25 location this company that is atlantic care is serious is a serious business that's boosted here respective turnover for nearly two decades we know decades means 10 years so that's for past 20 years this atlantic care pharmaceutical company is running successfully in new jersey and there they are uh, having their locations of no nearly 25 locations all over the country then the patient satisfaction is the single most important aspect of healthcare industry engaging in a renewed campaign of tkm proved a natural fit that means as i said earlier in case of this is a product manufacturing that is they are producing the medicines vaccines etc so the products that what you are delivering you should cure the patients so that is the main thing the firm chooses to adopt a plan do check act that means we used to say general as pdca cycle that means it is pdca cycle also we have discussed in the first unit as well that means before starting with the implementation of tkm we should know we this pdca that means what are the things that we are going to plan then what are the things that we are going to do then we are going to check with whether it will be feasible or not then if it is okay we will start with acting that means act means implementation then revealing the graphs 
what are the gaps that is identify in this implementation means revealing gaps in staff communication that means the employees are working in the industry and there should not be any gap among the employees those who are employed which subsequently mean longer patient waiting time and more complaints so due to the lack of communication among the various employees what happen is that there is a long wait time for the patients along with there are more complaints are there so this is a problem that we are identify uh, we know very well that uh, we are using design thinking approach in our institution that means basis of design thinking is itself first stage of design thinking we know it is empathize empathize means we want to know what is happening what is the problem that means identification of problem statement is the first phase like that this company that is alt atlantic care what i have done they have checked out what is the main root cause what is the problem incurred in their industry and what is the problem they have to find out the problem is more waiting time of the patients along with the more complaints so they have analyzed what is the reason for this and the root cause beyond this is the uh, lack of communication among the employees to tackle this managers explore a sideway method of internal communication that means they improve the communication among the various department within the industry that means main thing due to lack of communication to improve the communication they have decided and all the companies employees were given freedom to provide vital feedback at each and every level that means in general what will be happen means top level management will be only taking decision without getting the consent or feedback from the lower level of the employees in the industry but here what i have decided that they have filled the gap among the customer among the employees and they have decided that uh, employees at each and every level they have given powers to the employees at each and every level to give their feedback that means if they are giving feedback that such, such a process is not correct then the management is ready to accommodate the changes and the atlantic care decided to ensure all new employees understand the quality culture from the onset that means the company decided that all the employees either the existing employees or the new employees who are joining in the company should be aware of the culture this thing we are having in our institution also that we are saying it as sns culture that means for new faculties who are joining in our college what we are doing we are providing a initially orientation program or a faculty development program of initially of 10 to 15 days of training we are providing so that the faculties who are joining newly will get a idea about the sns culture like that this atlantic care provided training for the new employees to learn about the quality culture at orientation staff now receive a crash course in the company's performance excellence framework a management system that organizes the firm process into five key areas that means the management has decided these are the five main areas that we want to focus and work what are the five areas to say that is quality yes no other doubt whatever may be the industry quality is very very important followed by customer service then people and workplace that means where we are working then growth and financial performance that means in terms of finance how we can improve our industry how the revenue of the industry can be improved so all the employees should work on this basis that means first thing they should concentrate on quality they should call uh, focus on customer service then people and workplace that means place where we are working we should be satisfied that means it, it shows the concept of employee involvement only if there is involvement then the employee will work to his maximum extent thereby improving the performance of the overall industry as employees rise through the rank this emphasis on improvement follows as i said depending upon the hierarchy if an employee is getting promoted to the next level also he is having more responsibility on the increasing the efficiency of the industry after creating benchmark goals for employment to employees to achieve at all levels include better engagement at the point of delivery increasing clinical communication and identifying and pro- 
prioritizing service opportunities. That means we want to prioritize our work, which one is important, which one is uh, having the least importance. This Atlantic Care was able to achieve. That means once after implementation of the 2KM practice in their industry, that particular company is able to achieve to the next level. The number of repeated customers at the firm gets tripled. That means just think, just assume that initially if the customer is 20 lakh customers they are having means after implementation of this TQM, the number of customers gets tripled means it goes to a number of 60 lakhs customer by implementation of this TQM practices. That means main thing what they have done, they have uh, filled a gap between the employees who are working, that means the main root cause. The number of repeated customers, as I said, it has tripled and the market share hits a six year high. That means in the past six years, comparing with the past six years, once after implementation of this TQM, it, the market share gets very much high. Profit of, Profit also gets very surprised when there's such a profit over there. Firm revenue shot up from 280 million dollars to 650 million dollars. Just assume nearly more than two times of uh, profit has increased after implementing the quality improvement strategies. And next to say about the another company that is Santa Cruz Guitar Company Limited. It is a California based company, it's still a small scale manufacturing operation. This Santa Cruz guitar company has grown in recent times from a basement operation to a serious business. Here, what the thing is that it is a small scale industry, and here, what they are doing, they are manufacturing guitars up to 800 guitars per year, like that. So, the owner, Don Robert, he employs 14 expert craftsmen who create over 800 custom guitars every year. That means per year they have fixed it targeted 800 customized guitar. That means they will get the commands from the requirements from the customer. What is their requirement? Depending upon the requirement, they are producing the customized product. So in order to ensure the continue, continued quality of their instruments, Robert has created an environment that improves with each sale. That means in each sale, there should be certain improvement. That means the, for each sale, we are getting the request from the compli compliance, then what is the feedback from the customer. Based on this, each and every product is getting refined. In order to ensure the continuous quality of the instrument robot has created an environment that improves with each cell to keep things efficient the shop floor is divided into six workstations that means it is divided into six workstation that means the manufacturing of the lower body then uh, strings arrangement then setting up of the string then uh, testing like that they were divided the oh, entire company into six workstations and then partially assembled and then moved to next station each bench is Manned by senior craftsmen, and no guitar leaves the building station until he is 100% happy with its quality. As I said, that they have employed more number of senior, highly experienced craftsmen. So, what the thing in all the six workstations, these senior persons will be there. Only if they are satisfied to the 100% of the satisfaction, the particular product will move from that particular workstation to the another workstation. This product assembly line, however, unlike the traditional top to bottom factory, Robert is initially involved in all phases of instrument construction. That means he is the owner. Initially, what we will do, the general thing is that top to bottom factory. That means from the top level, they will give instruction that will be transferred to the middle level, supervisor level or manager level. In turn, it will be converted, it will be communicated to the employees level. So the employee will be doing the work, they will report the work to the supervisor followed by the report will be given to the top level management. Here it not like the traditional one. Here the owner that is Robert, what he has done is that he involved in each and every phases of instrument construction. Replacing this dotting method of quality management, it's difficult to see how customer wouldn't be satisfied within the autistic work. That means they have put their maximum effort. That means they have employed the best craftsmen in the industry, in their company, and they are giving each and every care in making in all the phases of manufacturing the guitar. So they are adapting such a method no doubt the customer will get dissatisfied. 
yet even it is very issue robert and other senior managers also spend much of their days personally answering well queries web queries about the instrument that means in case of any complaints the complaint customers will make call to the company and here the robert he itself will respond to the complaint or the top level of the craftsman who is well versed in that craftsmanship used to respond to the customers while robert has no intention of taking the manufacturing company to industrial high the quality of his instrument and high level of customer satisfaction speak for them so that means not like a core manufacturing company or another year not our bolt manufacturing company his aim is not to expand the company to very large scale manufacturing but his plan is only to make 800 guitars per year but the thing he real rely on quality and for the quality he has produced he is producing the customized guitar so each and every guitar once he is delivering to the customers what he is doing he is getting the feedback and if there is any error or any mistake he is doing the refining work so that no doubt his product is of maximum quality is delivering product of maximum quality now to say about the need of total quality management the most fundamental challenge was to create a positive approach that looks at improvement activities to essential for achieving target and goals that means initial thing what we have to do we want to fix a target as well as a goal that what we want to achieve when we are working towards the goal surely we can achieve the targets the highest challenge lay in creating the understanding across the organization dealing with huge employees in case of more number of employees are there in a organization surely it will be a huge problem then stating and documentation documenting improvement targets that means documentation of the targets is a very important and standardizing approaches and creating alignment to profit and goals that means we are fixing the target we are fixing the goal and standardizing the what is the standardized method that we are going to follow as i said due to trial and error or by means of getting the compliance or implementation of various quality tools they will finally come to an idea that these are the methods that we are going to implement in our industry this is the standardized one once it is standardized no doubt the quality the product will be of maximum quality and the customer will get satisfied once the customer gets satisfied the customer will be he will return the customer retention will be very good then steps taken by these two companies for implementing total quality management is understanding the customer needs as i say first company atlantic what they have what they have done the customer needs is nothing but curing of the disease and second one that is the guitar company what is the customer need is that it is a customized preparation of the manufacturing of the guitars as per the requirement of the customer so they understand the customer need that means in our language of design thinking we can say they well studied about the empathize stage of design thinking then improving the performance involvement of the employees this is very important in case of total quality management the involvement of employees is very important and to say that the third point is assigning responsibility to each and every employees in an organization the thing is that some of the person will have the responsibility while many of the person will not have responsibility so what will happen the person who are not assigned responsibility what they will think so it is not my responsibility to do the work even if they meet with the loss what they will say i was not given the responsibility if i was given the responsibility surely i might have succeeded this particular target like that he will say so that assigning target to each and every part of the employee is very much need so by these three methods they go implement total quality management in their concern and they have achieved in their business as well as in both in the performance as well as in case of profit thank you students and this last this slide and this uh, there shows the references from where this case studies is identified and similarly these are the various case, uh, references that i have taken into account so thanks for watching this case study thank you